offer isn't simply about throwing numbers out there at somebody. It's really more complex than that. I'm Andrea Harlan, and this is Smart Home Buying. do that. They just want to throw an offer out there, a lowball offer, and then say, hey, the seller can just counter me back and, you know, somehow eventually we'll meet somewhere in the middle. Well, the problem with that is there's different types of home sellers and people don't buy and sell homes. It's not their business usually. So they, most people just buy or sell a home two to three times in their lifetime. So for example, if you make a lowball offer and it's someone who is selling their house, they lived there for 40 years, their family grew up there and now they're ready to downsize. If you do an offer that's this lowball offer, it's gonna be offensive and they're gonna say, wait, no, I don't want to talk to you. I don't care about who's buying my house. They'll just react emotionally and then you, the door will be shut and that's that. So I really want you to get the results that you want and that's to get the house at the lowest price and still get the house. So the other way of negotiating is, is sometimes there's homes that are investor owned and they are only thinking about business. So the way we structure the offer and position the buyer in that case is different. It's really complex. And so in order to have more information about how I can help you, guide you through that process of making an offer, then make sure to contact me and I will definitely spend some time to help you understand the complex process of making an offer. And this is Andrea Harlan with Smart Home Buying.